family, our journey at the Village Museum continues. And we're gonna do the second part of our Village Museum tour. traditional village and what you see is more construction going on as they're looking to make this place look like a nice high-tech presentation to show the village uh, history as far as traditional living and culture What you're looking at is various cultures and tribes and their presentation of how the village community looks. Mr. Bomani, come here son, how are you? Are you enjoying your tour of the village museum? Huh? They want to know when you're going to come over there. To do what? Uh, the drumming and dancing? We're coming, I'm coming right now. I'm right here. All they got to do is give us a few minutes and we'll be over there for that presentation. And so, so these highlights, some of these huts are completed and some of them are under construction and some of them are just being rebuilt. <laughs> Look, uh, you have an animal storage here. Bah. And this one is dug deep on under the ground, and it's probably for a cooling purpose. And here you have more construction. So within a few years, family, all of these museums that we've been taking you to are gonna be just even more organized and set up a lot better. Uh, so that's what you see in the country of Tanzania. There's a whole lot of growth and development and this uh, set up to take the museums, the history and the culture to another level. So that's what's up. So this is the village shop. Hello. Right. Yeah, they don't see that. I work in private. If you take a picture, you ask me first. You ask me. Oh, uh, this is a different. Oh, this is different. Oh. Uh, if you buy something, you support it. Oh, this is not. Oh, this is different. Gotcha. This is baking. I removed the picture from from my phone. So no dishes. Okay. Right. 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 I, I was looking with uh, money here, see, I'm um, just, it well, looks like a higher, like my tribe. Okay. Um, I, I will explain more about my tribe, higher. Okay. Let me explain. Okay. Higher. Yeah, this is a uh, different material. Yes. Yeah. Did you see the ornamentation on the door, in the front? Oh, yes. This is, uh, okay. So, well. And I see you got a... Hi, I'm about to speaking from Kagera. So Kagera is northwest part of Tanzania. You pass on the Lake Victoria, then you reach Kagera. So Kagera is a compound of three countries, Uganda, Rwanda, and the Burundi. So higher, uh, in there Kagera is cool. There is mountains, there is a forest, 
there is a stones which are resembling like a human beings. Others look like a Jesus Christ. But also there is a waterfall. And there is a spring water very hot in a 70 centigrade. You can fetch it and put the tea, then you drink it. It's one there, Kagera region. So Kagera is the company of three countries, Uganda, Rwanda, and the Burundi. They cultivate banana for food and the coffee is for cash crops. So welcome, you get coffee in my tribe. But uh, higher, Tanzania, if you ask many professors around Tanzania, you ask professional people, doctor, teachers, <laughs> lawyers, engineering, you ask the higher. Why higher educated? Because during the colonial period, when the British and the Germans came, they passed the these three countries. Then they settled there, Kagera. So there they established school, seminars, hostels, churches. The men of the higher was educated and civilized. But the nature of the higher is to proud of themselves. So can you see a man is proud of educated man, brother, um, a senior civil servant. I mean, can they wait for us? I mean, they just start without us. I mean, I know they have to do what they have to do, but we're trying to finish our presentation. Let me uh, we'll explain more. Okay. I will explain more. Indeed. And so, family, we're going to break for some drumming and dancing. <laughs> 